Memorizing a script is really hard and unnecessary. If you're recording a video or a podcast and just can't get that one line right, it might be worth considering a teleprompter. You don't even need to buy one. You can turn your computer into one, and I'm going to show you three ways how to do that. The first way is for Mac users. The app is called Teleprompter Premium. It's a free app that you can download from the App Store. Simply copy your script, open up Teleprompter Premium, and add your script. Compose new script, name your script, and you can paste your script here. Now, as long as you highlight your script, you can change the sizing of the font along the bottom. Now, you're going to want to make this a little bit small because we're going to minimize the window in order to help your eyes from scrolling. Now, you're going to want to open up wherever you're recording. Maybe this is from your laptop camera. And then open the teleprompter app again. Minimize the screen. You're going to want to make this screen pretty small and position it up near the camera of your computer. This way, your eyes will look as if they're looking into the camera while you're reading. Try to keep your eyes on the first two or three lines as you speak to minimize as much movement in your eyes as possible. Once your script is added and your screen is resized, you can hit done in the top right hand corner. Now along the bottom here, you'll be able to change the speed of the scroll to match your comfort level. Press start and the teleprompter will start moving. The second way is for Mac and PC users, and it's online at telepromptermirror.com. I'll link that in the description of this video. Simply paste your script, and you can change the font size with the menu along the top, and you can also change the speed of the scroll to match your comfort level. Again, we're going to resize this window and put it up near the camera so that your eyes look like they're looking into the camera. When you're ready, you press play, and the teleprompter will start scrolling. The last way is also for both Mac and PC users, and it's online again at Riverside.fm. Riverside is great because you can record and use a teleprompter all within one app. You would simply create a new studio, let's call this one YouTube Videos, and enter the studio. On this page, you can select your camera and your microphone. I'm going to select my good microphone and select whether you are or are not using headphones and head into the studio. When you're in the studio, select script along the bottom. You can insert your script up here. Now press teleprompter. This will turn your script into a teleprompter. You can change the sizing of the font and you can change the scroll speed along the bottom. Press record when you're ready. And when you press play on the bottom of the teleprompter, it will start scrolling. You can also use this pop out button if you're finding it a bit distracting to see both your face and the teleprompter on screen. This will eliminate the video from your screen, but will still record in the background. Remember to keep your eyes on the top two or three lines to make sure that you're looking at the camera while you're recording. When you're done recording, end the recording. The recording will upload to the cloud. Select view recordings. After it uploads and processes, You'll have a high quality version available to download to edit externally. You can also use the Riverside editor and edit through our text-based editor. To learn more about how to use our editor, head to the video linked above. Using a teleprompter will greatly improve your video or podcast recording experience. Whether you choose to turn your computer into a teleprompter with an app like Teleprompter Premium, use online platforms like Teleprompter Mirror, or use an all-in-one solution like Riverside, the key is to make your delivery more smooth and sound more natural. So why struggle with memorization anymore? Give it a try and see the difference it can make in your videos. If you liked this video, make sure to hit that thumbs up button. And before you go, subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon so you never miss another video from Riverside. Thanks for watching this one. My name is Bridget, and I'll see you in our next one.